So here in the lobby of the Grand California, you can often come in during the holidays and they will have a special, usually for Christmas, they have the big Christmas tree in the center. And then they often have a holiday gingerbread house or Rice Krispie treat display. And at Halloween, usually it's Halloween themed, sometimes pumpkins. Uh, one year it was this really cool tree. I'll try and put a picture in of that. And they always have 13 hidden Mickeys for you to find. And I'm kind of whispering, but this is this year's. And it's Oogie Boogie. It's both sides. And you look through and you try and find the hidden Mickeys. Such as, if you look on the blue right here. There's a hidden Mickey. There's one on the orange bug right there in the center. And then, if you come around here, you'll see a red one right there on that. And so it's really fun just to kind of stop and look for hidden Mickeys. And then usually they have some, it's kind of late at night because this is after our dinner, but uh, they have a booth uh, set up here in the lobby where you can buy seasonal treats. And sometimes this is the only place you can get some of the seasonal treats. So it's well worth it to stop by when you're in the lobby. And look, another hidden Mickey. I'm on the second floor of the Grand Californian because if you ever come here and you're looking for all of the gingerbread hidden Mickeys uh, at Halloween, they have a Rice Krispie hidden uh, like display with hidden Mickeys and there's 13 of them. And so I will turn you around, but you have to come up here on the second floor and so the whole uh, lobby is out this way. And then you look down and you can usually see some that you can't see from the ground. And so we have 10 of the 13 hidden Mickeys. And so I'm hoping that I'm gonna find a couple from up here. All right, so let's peek over and see. Here's the lobby. And if you look down, and this works also with the gingerbread house. You can usually see hidden Mickeys from up here. So, um, let's see. Is that one right there? Let me zoom in. So do you see, I'm wondering if that's one right there in white. And I don't know, so I will take a picture of that and then zoom in later, but if you look, let me zoom out. Oops. Okay. If you look right there, do you see that one? And I can actually see that from the ground, but sometimes you can't see them. Is that one right there? That looks like one right there, doesn't it? So I'm going to keep looking. I'm not going to bore you with looking. Um, but anyway, that's just a tip. If you're looking for the hidden Mickeys on any of the gingerbread or the Halloween make, then um, come up here and you might be able to find them. 
So I don't really feel like that one in the rock counts. It's a little bit distorted, but I'm really not seeing anything else up from up here that would be considered a hidden Mickey. And I'll try and see that white one from the back, but the problem is that there are, when you're looking at it at night, there are, let me back up, there are spotlights coming from over here and over here, and they shine straight back this way. So if you're on this side and you're looking to see the candy on this side, you really can't see it. So um, I think from here, the only one that kind of even looks close is that one on the rock from up here. Everything else, I looked on the dice. I was positive there would be one on the dice because it's got the dots, but I only see skulls and I've looked at every side of the dice so far and there aren't any on the top. So I think we kind of struck out and we may be stuck only at 10 hidden Mickeys for this year, but that's pretty good. We got most of them. Okay, well, I don't know about you, but I totally just love looking for the hidden Mickeys and things. And so this is one of my favorite things to do. When I come to the Grand California, it's to try and find the hidden Mickeys in whatever holiday display that they have. So I hope that if you stop by during one of the holidays, whether it's Halloween for the Halloween display or for the Christmas gingerbread house, that you'll look for the hidden Mickeys and then you'd be sure to come up to the second floor and look over the balcony and see if you find any on the roof or from the top view.